everyone, and welcome once again to another edition of the Red Brown and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins, along with Jennifer Brown Day. And Jennifer, before we get started today with the listings we're going to talk about, you know, I'm sh I've had a lot of people come up to me since we've been doing this show and say, how many offices do they have? Where are they located? What area uh, do you all list homes? So let's go over those office locations before okay. we start. We've got four offices, mm -hmm. as you know. Paintsville is our main office, and then we have Prestonsburg, Pikeville, and Louisa. But we do service the entire area of the Eastern Kentucky Association of Realtors. So that's about 15 counties total. So pretty much anything in Eastern Kentucky we can help you with. And that is help with buying or selling. Absolutely. And a lot of people, there's that misconception of, I only need a realtor to list my home. Mm -hmm. But if you're coming into an area and you, you know there's see certain things you want, you guys can put a search in there and come up with that and you can help them through the entire process. We can, so buying, selling, and then we also do a lot of other real estate mm -hmm. type activities. So if you were looking for an appraisal, an auction, if you need property management, lease, anything like that, we can help you. All right, and I'm sure throughout the show we're going to be throwing out a bunch of different numbers and contact information for you and, and a couple of your other realtors, so yes, we will. pay attention. You'll know <laughs> how to contact all of them very soon. Now, first, let's start off with a listing that is yours in mm -hmm. Floyd County. Okay. The first one we're going to do is off Daniels Creek in Floyd County, like mm -hmm. you mentioned, which, if you're familiar with that area, is extremely convenient to US 23. And that is, if you're going north on 23 and you go through the Ival community, it's mm -hmm. a right-hand turn right before you get to the Allen Red Lights. Correct. So you talked about convenience. Well, that'll tell you. Right, you're smack between Prestonsburg and Pikeville, and then you've got just another step to Paintsville. Exactly. And then, you, of course, you're right there off 23, so you have access to the four lane. Uh, but you also have, if you have never turned down in Daniels Creek, a lot of people don't even realize this neighborhood is back in there. But I highly recommend that you do if you're interested in looking in mm -hmm. that area because there are some beautiful homes. It's a really nice community. And this home is no exception. It's a fairly new build. It was built in 2006. And it's a four bedroom, two and a half bath home that is ready for a new owner. And the one thing I love about this one is you said four bedrooms and two and a half bathrooms, but every one of the bedrooms has a walk-in closet. Mm -hmm. That tells me there's a great use of space in this home. Exactly, there is. And this is one, something else that a lot of people like is it has a first floor master. Mm -hmm. Like you said, it of course has a walk-in closet attached and a private bathroom. So you also have a little bit of separation between the master bedroom and then the three other bedrooms on the second floor. And then if you look at one of the pictures, it shows a rear view of the home. So then you get into this outdoor living space. It mm -hmm. looks like you've got a lot of decking. You've even got decking on the second floor and then this huge yard. The entire lot is, is three-tenths of an acre, but it looks so much bigger than that. It is. It's a really nice lot. It's all fenced. It's got privacy fencing um, throughout the backyard. So if you wanted to add swing sets, if you wanted to have pets, if mm -hmm. you wanted to add a pool, you have plenty of room to do that. And this one also has an attached two-car garage that is a little bit extended. It's got a really high ceiling and that kind of stuff in it. So if anybody wants to use the extra storage, this also has that. Okay. Now this one, like we said, is located on Daniels Creek and the price on this one has just been reduced. So I anticipate a lot of interest on this one. So the price is now 225000 for everything we just told you with the convenience of Daniels Creek and everything else that goes with it. So this is your listing. Let's throw out your phone number. Okay. My cell phone number is 606-793-0991. All right. And the Pikeville office number is 437-2333. Mm -hmm. All right. Now moving to the next listing. This is one of Matt Boyd's listings in Pike County. Correct. And this one is located in the Coal Run area. It is Mullins Edition, if you're familiar with that area, right off 23. And this is another one that's just gone through a big price reduction. So that's why we're making sure and sharing it with everybody today. And I love this one for the same reason on, on that last one. You've got this huge yard space. Mm -hmm. And I love that you've included the picture of the, the swing set and the play area because that lets you know this one's great for a family. Exactly. You have plenty of room for swing sets. Again, pools kids, pets, mm -hmm. anything you would want outside, you have space for it. And then on your first floor, um, you've got a large living room, family room, you've got a fireplace, and this is that time of year when those fireplaces <laughs> are starting to get even more attractive. Exactly, and this is another house that's got a first floor bedroom. So you have that bedroom on the first floor and the other rooms are going to be up on the second. Right. And this one is neat because we talked about the yard space, but 
you know, there's yard space on both sides of the house. So mm -hmm. it's not sitting out onto one side of the lot where you lose a lot of that. It's right in a good spot in the middle of the property. Exactly. And like we said, it is all fenced. So you've got a little bit of privacy back there. You have a large patio for grilling or cookouts, anything mm -hmm. like that. You've got it all. All right. Now this is one that people may want to take a look at here in Pike County. 220000 is that price, and like we said, it just went through a price reduction. So give uh, Matt Boyd in the Pikeville office a call. Let's give his cell phone number. Okay. His cell phone number is 434-2215. All right. And when you do give him a call, mention 107075. That's the MLS number for that specific listing. Mm -hmm. All right. Moving on, another one of Matt's listing um Move back toward Pikeville just a little bit. This one's on Ratliff Creek. Yes, right off Ratliff Creek, it's on Hillcrest Heights. If you're familiar mm -hmm. with Ratliff Creek coming from 23, you only go about a half a mile up Ratliff Creek and you take a right on Hillcrest Heights. And this one sits up on the hill and it's a really neat location because you are half a mile from 23, but you are in a very private location. And when you talked about private, actually, if you're gonna drive up Ratliff Creek, you're not gonna be able to see this home from the main road. Exactly. You are a little bit off the main road of Ratliff's Creek. And this is one you can sit in your living room and enjoy the view. It also has, which I didn't include a picture of, but it's got a separated deck that kind of sits over the hill mm -hmm. that you can sit out there and really enjoy the views, kind of hanging off the hill and, and uh, grill out or whatever you'd want to do. The uh, formal living room has a fireplace in it. It's got the wood beams. It's got the hardwood floor that's real dark. And then it mm -hmm. opens up to the second floor kind of uh, open area. And then both of the bedrooms on the second floor also have cathedral ceilings. So like you said, the rooms feel very spacious. And this, like you said, you know, we were talking about just being right outside of technically the city limits of Pikeville, but mm -hmm. you've got the convenience of everything that Pikeville has to offer. So you're out in the country, but you're right there. Exactly, exactly. And this is one, I mean, you're less than a mile away from the high school. You're very close to all the shopping um, out at Cassidy Boulevard. So again, like you said, you can't beat the location. This one at Hillcrest Heights uh, is Matt Boyd's listing. The price on this one, very attractive, 159.5. That's correct, and I'm going to give the Pikeville office number if that's okay. okay. You can call 606-437-2333. And you can email Matt, and he is just like most of your realtors on their email address, and it's mboyd at rbandw.com. Correct. Now, moving to the next listing, this one is another one that you get that country feel that we're going to tell you where it is, but you can't see it from the road. Exactly, and this one is right downtown. You can't escape. You're right downtown, but this house in itself is an escape. I mean, you really are in a very private location. And, you know, I love Smith Hill. Mm -hmm. Then this is where this one is uh, in Pikeville because you are, like you said, you're above everything downtown Pikeville has to offer. But like this time of year and in the summertime, you are enveloped in all this green. But when those leaves fall, you've got the view of all views over mm -hmm. top of Pikeville. So it's really like you have the best of both worlds. And this is a two bedroom, two bathroom home mm -hmm. um, located on Smith Hill. And it, like you said, it's a ranch, so it's all one level. Mm -hmm. That's something you don't find often on the side of a hill because normally they're stacked with multiple levels or split levels, but this is a ranch. It is, it's a ranch. It has all the bedrooms, all the main living space on that floor. It does also include a partially finished basement. So if you wanted to do a studio apartment possibly mm -hmm. and, and rent something out, there's a possibility of doing that. Or you can just have the extra space for a game room, storage, whatever you'd want. And you did include, and I'm glad you did, a picture of that deck that mm -hmm. actually wraps around the home. So evenings, mornings, I mean, you can imagine where somebody would love to be. Exactly. And the great thing is, let's say it's raining or something like that and you don't want to sit out on the deck, the house features, and you can see it in some of the pictures, floor to ceiling windows. So if you want to sit in the living room on a little bit of colder day during mm -hmm. the winter and not go out on the deck, you can sit in there and it's like you're sitting outside in the middle of the snow. All right. Well, this was one that people are going to want to call for a showing mm -hmm. because the pictures aren't going to do this one justice. You have to be standing up on that hill. Exactly. I would highly recommend setting up a showing. Okay. Now, this one, as we said, is Matt Boyd's listing, so give that Pikeville office number again. Mm -hmm. That number is 606-437-2333. 
124.9 is the price for this one on Smith Hill, which is a great price for everything you're getting. Um, and that MLS number is 107352. So when you give him a call or email him, tell him those numbers, he'll pull that listing right up. Absolutely. Now, we'll finish the show with back to one of your listings, mm -hmm. and this one's also right downtown Pikeville and another one that you have no idea you're downtown. Exactly. This is one of my favorite neighborhoods to talk about just because you're Chloe Ridge subdivision, mm -hmm. which is literally the top of downtown Pikeville. You can see everything from up there. You have the views. Your view is mountain, country, and then you come down the hill and you're right in the middle of downtown Pikeville. Right. And this is one, it's a four bedroom, three full bath, and it's got all the extras. So mm -hmm. you've got the two story foyer, the kind of the grand foyer. You've got a two story living room that also has floor to ceiling windows so that you can see out back over your in ground pool and over uh -huh. to the mountains from the first or second floor, which is a really neat feature. And this is, is if you've never driven up there, you know, during the day one day, if you, if you ever drive up there, you'll understand what we're talking about with these views. Especially, let's go back to this time of year again, we're getting ready to have those beautiful colors. And just think about it, next fall, you could be sitting in your living room, this could all be yours. Exactly. And this is one, something, speaking of the enjoying the view, this is one that also has a screened in porch on the back. I already mentioned the mm -hmm. pool, but I love a screened in porch because you can enjoy the outdoors just a little bit longer with that cover and that kind of stuff. So this has one that you really can enjoy the outdoors all season long. And looking at that interior picture of that kitchen, mm -hmm. white kitchens are very popular now. We just <laughs> talked about it with a listing not too long ago. And with the, the way the bar comes around and you've got the stools, I mean, we're getting ready to look into Thanksgiving and Christmas and this screams family gatherings. Absolutely. And the entire first floor is very open. It does have a formal living room and a formal dining room, but the whole back of the house is a very casual living room that's very oriented with family meetings and, and that open layout. And then it has a small dining area and that big open kitchen. So it really is conducive to huge family gatherings or anything like that. And at first look at this home, you would think not you would think, oh, it's an executive style home. One of those you go in and you're afraid to touch anything. You know, that kind of thing. But that's not what I'm getting from this home at all. This is a comfortable home. This is a family home. This is one that you walk in and you can see yourself living in. Okay. Well, hopefully people will want to see themselves living in it. Uh, so the best way to start doing that is with a showing. Absolutely. Now, how can <laughs> they get that showing scheduled? You can call the Pikeville office. That number is 606-437-2333. All right. The price on this one is $549, which with everything you're getting is a bargain. Absolutely. Especially right here in downtown Pikeville. <laughs> so give Jennifer a call. Um, and you can get your showing scheduled. So I think we've done a good job today of, of going across the board of all different kinds of listings in Pike and Floyd County today. But like we said, you've got four offices, not just Pike and Floyd, 15 counties, did you say? 15 counties is what we're going to cover. And feel free to call any of our four offices for any listing. If you live in Paintsville mm -hmm. and you want to move to Pikeville, feel free to call the Paintsville office and talk to them about our listings because we can show anything. All right. Okay. I'm going to step out and let Jennifer do a real estate minute. Are you ready for the winter season? Today we will discuss a few items that may help you get your home ready for the upcoming cold months. First, take the time to clean out gutters and draining systems from leaves, dirt, and runoff that comes with the fall season. Secondly, trim back landscaping and prepare your yard for the cold weather. Finally, if your home is not currently occupied, consider having the home winterize to lessen the chance of pipes freezing. Thank you for joining us for another episode of the Red Rana Williams Show. We hope you will call one of our offices soon to list your home or to set up a showing.